Hello guys, if you are watching this video, I'm pretty sure that you are looking to edit your channel navigation. Now, let's suppose you are a newbie on this YouTube channel and you have recently created one. And if you go to your home page, then you might see something like this, which, are, which you are looking at on my page. Like on your home page, you'll have all the activities which are done by you. Maybe you have uploaded one video, maybe you have subscribed to somebody's channel, maybe you are liking some channels, videos, and so and so. So all your activities would be on your home page. Now let's suppose you want something like this, where you can have on your home page something like all your uploads, what to watch next, then all your uploads over here in this fashion, like on horizontal form, uh, a couple of shows if you have then uh, something like uh, popular uploads in vertical fashion so how do you do that all right so that is a part of editing your channel navigation which when you are logged in inside your youtube channel what you need to do is you just have to bring your cursor right above the subscribe button where it says pencil all right there would be a pencil icon you just click on this and you have three options out of which you have to click on the first one that is edit channel navigation so once we click on edit channel navigation, you'll have this option of customizing the layout of your channel, then you'll have to click on enable. And once you are done enabling it, just click on save. And that's it. That's it. So you'll have all these options by default on your home. So for returning visitors or returning subscribers, how do you want your channel to be? For your new visitors, how do you want your channel to be? All right. So let's suppose for my returning subscribers, I want something like this, what to watch next, all right? So I ha I'll have all these things over here. If you want to still edit this part, you'll have to click on this pencil right over here and you'll have the feature content over here. So let's suppose I click on this, I want the feature um, content as uh, probably I'll go for this LinkedIn ads tutorial 2016. And if I click on this, I'll save this and there you go, bingo. So now I have this over here and if I just click on done, it would be done. So all my returning subscribers would first see this one, LinkedIn ads tutorials 2016. All right. And let me do it by default. If I want to do it by default, then I'll say latest activity and if I click done, then it would be the same. All right. Now, if I want to have a look and feel, which is something different for my new visitors, what I'll have to do is click on new visitors tab. I'll go to this pencil icon once again for the same and I'll click on change trailer. So basically, this is a trailer for your YouTube channel. So I'll click on change trailer. Maybe I'll just have this one and I'll click on save. That's it. Bingo. It is saved. All right. And then what if I want to add all the sections over here? All right, what if I want to add this sections? So you have this button called add a section. Now, just because I already have this, so let me just delete this, All right? Let me just remove it. Uh, I'll say delete, and let me just add all the sections once again. So now, as I don't have any section, it will say add a section. If I click on add a section, I'll have to select any of this. I get a hell lot of options where I can put it a section. All right, so let's say I want my uploads to be on this horizontal panel or vertical list, whatever you say. So let's say I want it uh, in a horizontal row, just as like this. If I scroll down on this channel, I have all these uploads over here with all this play all button and the uploads. So what I need to do is I just need to click on uploads, select horizontal row, and if I say done, bingo, there it is. So now I have all my uploads over here. All right, so let's add one more section and let's say I want a section which is this one, popular uploads. So I'll once again go over here, I'll say popular uploads and I'll say vertical list. And as soon as I click on done, bingo, within a second it would be over here. So all my popular uploads, now how popular counts is according to number of views. The video which has maximum number of views would be on the top. Then the second lowest number of views would be on the second place. So this is how your popular uploads come in the picture. All right. So if you want to add more sections, let's say one more and I would say multiple playlists. 
and if I say horizontal row I'll add a couple of lists over here let's say I want to have a section title like uh, this is the playlist which you might not want to miss out and I'll click on find playlist and there you go all my playlists will be over here so let's select uh, my playlist I'll select uh, LinkedIn marketing I'll also select YouTube marketing and that's it probably I'll select everything or maybe yeah so let's just delete this Facebook it's not looking good and I'll select WordPress tutorials that's it and let's say done uh, let's click one time and that it this is the playlist which you might not want to miss out there it is all my playlists are over here all right so if I click on this button it would be up all right so it would be up now see this is looking something good now if you want to see and check for yourself whether it's looking nice for a new visitor or not you might want to click on this yourself button that is view as new visitor so let's just click on view as new visitor as soon as I'm over here now this is something which a new visitor would see on my channel so this video would automatically play it will have the description over here and then if he scrolls down then he would be able to see this uploads right so this is just for new visitors now let's say I want to see how my channel would look like when it is a return for a subscriber returning subscriber so I check for returning subscriber and let's see how it looks so this is how it is looking for a returning subscriber all right so I click on done once again and that's it so probably we have a nice channel navigation for ourselves and if I just want to once again update this one I'll say latest upload and I'll remove this so now it is looking better better than before and I will say it is done so I hope this video uh, got something some insights on navigation of your channel and See you in the next video guys. Till then take care. Bye-bye.